Now all eyes are on Georgia as voters are at the polls right now for Georgia's historic twin Senate runoff elections. We have a team of reporters for you covering all the candidates and all the angles and the problems that we found at some of the polling places in Cobb, Fulton and Gwinnett counties. Now, Republican Senator Kelly Leffler taking on Democrat Reverend Raphael Warnock and Republican Senator David Perdue trying to fight off Democrat John Ossoff. Both races extremely close in the general election. Our Rebecca Schramm kicking things off with our live team coverage right now. She's in Cobb County. And Rebecca, what kind of turnout are you seeing there? Well, Karen, it's slow but steady. I want to show you where we are. We're at the Smyrna Community Center. If you'll walk over here with me, you can see uh, the crowd here. I want you to think back to early voting. People had to wait in long lines here when this was one of a handful of early voting locations. But now that it's a regular Election Day voting precinct, for just the voters who live in this immediate area, casting a ballot is a breeze. Very quick and easy. You're in and out. With 42% of Cobb County's voters casting ballots early in person or absentee and 141 precincts open today, there's lots of breathing room at the polls for voters showing up for the runoffs. Georgia, we have to hold the line. In recent days, the biggest names in the Republican Party have visited Georgia to stump for Senators Kelly Leffler and David Perdue. This could be the most important vote you will ever cast John and the Reverend. And the most well-known Democrats have come to stump for Raphael Warnock and John Ossoff. They're principled, they're qualified, they're decent. Did any of that sway your vote did you, or did you kind of already know? Not really. I kind of already knew and I did my own research. Um, I don't follow the commercials and the he say and the hearsay. Not really. I have my mind made up for a while now, so I didn't really get swayed. Yes and no, because I feel like at the end of the day, everyone has like their own opinion of who they're already going to vote for. The big question mark is whether disgruntled Trump supporters will turn out today. I have friends on both sides of the spectrum, so Everybody I've talked to has still gone out and voted. And taking another live look, of course, he's talking about here in the metro area. It'll be interesting to see what the turnout is in rural areas where Trump is extremely popular. Of course, we'll be watching as the results come in. We have this footnote for you. President Trump tweeted this morning that he now has the support of both Republican senators, David Perdue and Kelly Leffler, as uh, he challenges the electoral process later this week. We'll stay on top of that one as well. Live in Smyrna and Cobb County, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News. We will